Hello, my name is Martin Bele and this is uh, African Way Life and today I'm bringing you the thing um, it's uh, 10 things you didn't know about Kilimanjaro mountain Kilimanjaro mountain is well known for the being of the highest mountain in Africa and it's uh, and uh, for its grasses but there is so much more of this mountain story than you are probably aware here are 10 things you may well not know about the icon mountain Kilimanjaro the mountain Kilimanjaro is also believing it's a uh, second mountain highest mountain in the world after the first one uh, the first position held by this Everest so the second mountain is it's a uh, Kilimanjaro which is found in uh, Africa to the country known as Tanzania it's nearer to Kenya so some uh, Kenyans they try to or some tourists think maybe the Kilimanjaro it's in Kenya but this Kilimanjaro it's in Tanzania Tanzania the first thing you didn't know about the uh, Kilimanjaro mountain it's um the last volcanic activity on the mountain Kilimanjaro occurred 200 years back resulting into the ashes pit that climbers can see from Uhuru Peak today the mountain Kibo volcanic cone is dormant and could erupt again one day hopeful this is gonna erupt one day because you know volcanic it's um, when it's inside there it's keeping you know, it's keeping recycling itself but when it is up it might erupt so we think one day it might and uh, the second thing is um, almost every kind of ecological system is found in Kilimanjaro at the base of the mountain you will be find cultivated farmland then you will ascend into the rainforest then the earth and the moorland then the alpine desert and the arctic summit that's the second you will find uh, every kind of uh, ecological system that Kilimanjaro it's, it's wonderful and uh, the third thing is uh, Kilimanjaro's mountain snow caps have lost about 80 percent of their mass since 1912 and some scientists believe there could be no ice or snow left at all in 20 years later thanks to climate change no better time to climb than right now then but um, you know we are losing natural weight if you are losing 80 percent of it um, it's better we can have that you can have 100 percent of it so it can be the greatest but due to climate change we cannot do anything for that better to keep our environment safe and then maybe let's keep praying and the fourth thing is uh, approximate 20,000 climbers attempt to submit Kilimanjaro every year with roughly two-thirds of these numbers achieving the feat here at Kilimanjaro experience the success rate is much higher here in Kilimanjaro most of people are just successful rich to the, to the, to the, to the top there most of them because um, it's not that hard you know. and the five thing is uh, Kyle Maynard who has no arms and no legs managed to crawl to the summit of Kilimanjaro and assisted back in 2012 so this is amazing guy will have no arms no legs he also climbed to the mountain unassisted without being assisted you know when it, someone is assisted but he was not assisted no arms no legs this is a real motivation to other people to climb this mountain and uh, number six uh, between six and seven people died on Kilimanjaro every year mostly due to altitude sickness hypothermia or accidental falls in the in uh, 2013 a climber died from being struck by lightning i'm very sorry for you you are trying to see the mountain but you died but who knows but that can be it to be a, uh, to make us afraid to climb this mountain we can just climb it's beautiful mountain the name kilimanjaro has no has no universal agreed upon translation or original mountain of greatness mountain of caravans shining mountain mountain of the cold devils or even the unlike little mountain are among of some of the speculative translation suggestions from the various different local language dialects 
doesn't have a specific uh, translation of this mountain. Some people are saying that caravan, some people are saying called devil's greatness. So there is no say specific. Number eight, almost unbelievable. Johan Kinyala Lauo, a Tanzanian porter who escorted two Europeans on every first recorded Kilimanjaro summit in 1889, lived to see the 100th celebration of the climb at 118 years of age in 1989. He eventually died at the age of 125. What amazing! This person died while having 125 years. That's amazing. Unbelievable. Some of us now we cannot treat that years. We don't know. Maybe, maybe climate change. <laughs> Number nine. Though much of Kilimanjaro is very inhospitable, the mountain is home of 140 different types of marmorders mur and uh, 179 different bird species. Bush babies, blue monkeys, and black and white colbus monkeys are often spotted in the rainforest sections, where some of where some have been claimed to spot buffalo and elephant. Yeah, elephant, buffalo, mammal species, different species are found on this Kilimanjaro mountain. Welcome and see for yourself. So number ten and the last one it is um Kilimanjaro is its own flow ember emblem which is called the impatient Kilimanjaro and is found at the any level of 2600 feet and 9986 9, feet in the forest. It is noted for its dazzling and the red and yellow petals which look like flames and over the years has been become the emblem of the mountain. So these are 10 things we didn't know about Kilimanjaro mountain. Hopefully you enjoy my, what I bring it to you in front of you. So don't forget to subscribe, to like and comment.